Hey everyone, and welcome back to Rex TV. Today, I want to talk about the recent warning by Zimbabwe's President Emerson Nangogwa against protesters planning to demonstrate at the upcoming Southern African Development Community SADC summit. Nangogwa has warned against any protests during the SADC summit, stating that such actions would be met with a heavy-handed response from the security forces. This warning comes amidst growing discontent and frustration with the government's handling of the country's economic and political challenges. The SADC summit is an important meeting of leaders from the region, and it provides an opportunity for member countries to discuss and address issues of mutual concern. However, the warning from Nangogwa raises concerns about the potential for a crackdown on dissent and freedom of expression. It's important to recognize that peaceful protest is a fundamental right in any democratic society. Citizens should be able to peacefully voice their grievances and concerns without fear of reprisal or violence from the authorities. The warning issued by Nangogwa is a troubling sign of the government's intolerance for dissent and opposition. The international community should pay close attention to the developments leading up to the SADC summit and be vocal in condemning any attempts to suppress peaceful protest and freedom of expression in Zimbabwe. It's crucial for all stakeholders, including the SADC and its member countries, to uphold the principles of democracy and human rights. The people of Zimbabwe deserve to have their voices heard and their concerns addressed in a peaceful and inclusive manner. As the SADC summit approaches, it's important for the international community to continue to support the people of Zimbabwe in their quest for democracy, freedom and justice. We must stand in solidarity with those who seek to peacefully exercise their fundamental rights and hold their government accountable. I urge all of you to stay informed about the situation in Zimbabwe and to lend your support to the people who are advocating for positive change in their country. Let's continue to raise awareness and speak out against any attempts to suppress dissent and peaceful protest in Zimbabwe and around the world. Thank you for watching, and I hope you will join me in standing up for democracy and human rights in Zimbabwe.